Today is something a little different. I'm way out in North Saanich again. I'm out in Coles Bay. That's a really, really nice park out here. And talking about parks, I don't know if you saw it or not, but the CRD, the ones that were gonna put paid parking in about seven to, I think it was nine other parks in the CRD. Well, they had their meeting the other night and they said, no dice. <laughs> I was really surprised. They said they're not gonna put the parking meters in there. So you can still enjoy the parking for free, which is great. But the one thing that really surprised me is there's still two parks that have parking meters and now they're thinking of taking it out of them. So <laughs> doesn't get much better than that, does it? Well, all right, I'm gonna check out Coles Bay today. I want you to come with me. It's gonna be a beautiful day. It's just clearing off right now. And uh, yeah, this place has got a lot to offer. Let's go have a look. Coles Bay is just out here in Ardmore area and you know I've never really seen it really busy here before I imagine it does get that way in the summertime but since it's Friday the 13th today in October yeah Friday the 13th I'm not superstitious but uh, the only speeding ticket I ever got was on Friday the 13th and that was in 1969 so uh, maybe I'm due I don't know but we're gonna go for a walk. Looks like the trails are in really good shape right now. So uh, let's go check this place out. Yeah, they've got all your information you need here just before you head into the park. And then uh, we'll go down there and have a look. Oh no, there's a lost kitty around here somewhere. Oh. And let's see what we got here. It's your typical do's and don'ts in the park. But it looks like a very, very nice path. I don't think it was this nice when I was out here the last time so we're gonna go down it's not far down to the water if I remember correctly I think there's a some type of a washroom facility down here I, I really can't remember but we'll have a look oh there's some big trees in here too wow I know that this park gets well used out on the water a lot of people who have yachts I know like to come to Coles Bay to anchor overnight because it's very protected so there's that but if you don't have a yacht you can still enjoy it from shore and uh, I don't know what the tide's going to be like today but maybe there'll be tidal pools down there something we can explore I'm not really sure but oh yeah that looks kind of cool I remember they had this um, bridge here, but I doubt very much if there's any water. Oh yeah, these paths are definitely in really good shape. Just what I expected. Yeah. Kind of dry as a bone down here. Though we've had a few days of rain lately, so I know that the ground is damp and the moss and everything looks nice and green so uh, there is that i don't think this is a fish creek this one so that's all right so I'd, let's just carry on down and see what we can see down here They do have a little picnic area here that's great and looks like it'd be great for playing frisbee or the dog or something like that. Ah, I was right. There is some type of a washroom facility here. Look at that. Not bad. And it's good for wheelchairs too.
yeah, I just <laughs> just had a little peek and the tide is out a little way. So uh, oh, I wish I brought my boots. I in my street shoes once again. So let's go have a look and see if there's anything happening down here. There's some beautiful homes along the water here too. Well, this has been improved too. I remember the last time I came down here, it was um, you had to go down a little dirt path onto the beach, but there's steps here now. Well, that's good. Well, this is interesting. There's, uh, I don't know if you can see them, but there's lots of raccoon tracks. So the raccoons have been down to the beach down here. So uh, that would have been earlier, I'm sure, because I don't see any, any of them around here right now. But I know that the raccoons like to come down, especially in the evenings, and uh, dig up clams and such. Oh, that's not too bad. The I thought the ground would be softer than this, but it's quite nice. There's a, there are a few boats anchored out here that belong to the people on shore too, but it's a good sized bay. And it's only like uh, two bays up from Butchart Gardens and Brentwood Bay, so. Very nice down here. wander up the other way and see if there's anything interesting up this side. When the creek's flowing, that's where it comes in right along here. But nothing there today. I've walked down to the other end of the beach here and I saw another beach access going up into the forest area so I'll wander back and go up there and see where that goes. Okay here's the other way up. Nice uh, set of steps here coming up from the beach and you've got a uh, bench here to sit and relax and look at the view. I'll take a picture of what you'd be looking at if you sit on this bench. As I was sitting on the bench here, uh, <laughs> it's so nice I don't really want to leave, but there's been a couple of harbor seals have come in and are going back and forth, but they're just out a little bit too far to get a picture of them. So I was just going to sit here for another couple of minutes and see if they come in to see me or not. Oh, yeah, he's still he's probably 150 yards offshore. He's swimming along out there. Oh, well, I'll give it a couple of minutes. No, the seal didn't want to visit, so I'm going to wander out of here now and check out the rest of this park here. So. On the trail right from the washroom when you turn right from the washroom you come out it's a nice trail that goes along and skirts along the back of uh, all these waterfront houses here 
and you've got lots of park on the inside but we're going to wander back and go up through this other trail over here And that brings you back up to the parking lot. There are a couple more cars here now. Huh. I could have had company. I wonder where they went. I didn't see them. Well, that was Coles Bay Park out in Ardmore. I'll uh, put the address down there so uh, you can bleep blop it. So that'll be it for me today. Lots of interesting things to look at down there. The tidal pools are awesome. Hopefully some of that footage turned out with my macro lens, but uh, who knows? I don't know till I look at it. All right, stay safe, and let's get out there and have some walks again. Bye for now. <laughs>